biggest project of my life. So I started documenting more of my life, more of my grind, more of my hustle, more of my ups and downs in hopes of inspiring other people. I'm lit up and I want to fucking do everything. And I was doing that thing at MTV and I called it Project MTV. And then after MTV, it was like, it's not Project MTV, it's Project My Life. This week in rehab, maybe even today, we're going to start doing some, some bigger lifts. Feel good. Significant difference though, man. There's nothing healthy available, and you don't understand. <laughs> yeah. Seven, 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 seven. Oh, almost! Yeah. Like uh, maybe two months ago. Oh, it's you. It took a while yeah. for them to do it. It's fucking awesome. Like they're recognizing me as the person that I want to become. I get inspired by. You making a commitment again yeah. and having the courage to come in here again and say, yeah. dude, I fucked up. Glad I, did. I want to come back. I'm glad I'm sitting here right now. Me, me too, man. Yeah, yeah. It makes my heart smile. Thank you. Thank you. From snowy New Jersey. Me too. No. <laughs> to sunny LA. Sure. Hi, I'm Anthony. Kennedy. We've been promoting now, my wife and I, since 2011 or 12. 12. Mm -hmm. 2012. I'm grateful to be here. Categories. You have specific information. The way she's posing them and the way that her legs. Competitors are more educated <coughs> now. A rocky thing now, right? Like the comeback. Like I got just least. And plus, my last one, it was like yeah, second you were place. So close. Like that My last time on this stage was in 2000, 2012. I did it. Um, 2018 was my last time competing, but I didn't. I didn't do the world. This is where you welcome them with a little bit of enthusiasm. But the thing is, we, we no, so, so there is no excuse not to try. Why did I get like? I'm, I'm like, so I'm not crying. Like, I'm gonna cry. There you go. Pops has been like my my pops in the industry. Project my life. I love you, bro. I love you, man. Uh, can you have enough enough mass? Our chef. Thank you. Oh, okay. And he won it as a novice. In That's wrap for now. <laughs> Who's gonna see this video? Everybody in the universe. He's got an X factor, though, man. Yeah. Hey, whether he was standing differently or what, he yeah. had he had the broad shoulders, the small waist, and the quads. Yeah. You want to eat, bro? <laughs> you want a meal? He's so fucking smart. Looks so dumb. No, at the same time. So dumb at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Hi. Yeah. Hello. You look wonderful. <laughs> it's crazy world okay, of Karen. Cool. What happens if you repping that thing? What happens if he did? He competed, smoked Everything. the, the pro division. <laughs> Inspired to like take my shirt off, take a pose, yeah, and I'll take a picture with you. Yeah, just yeah, to we'll compare let's myself. Let's do it, man. I just want to look at myself next to the champ right here. I yes, you do. It is missing. You enjoyed it? Thank you. Good stuff, man. Hell yeah. Great Digby. Anthony Nacer, how are you? What's up, bro? How are you, man? How are you? Guys, the office is a wreck, man. Podcast, but, I mean, dude, I love creating content. Oh, this was awesome. Man. It was, man. I appreciate it. Hard.
that's awesome. Guys, real quick, let's just start off because this is going to be wrapped up into um, audio for podcast, iTunes, and the video obviously will go on to YouTube for, for some visuals. Fucking killed it, bro. One and done, baby. You're seeing by the time those muscles hit the low back. Well, I appreciate you having a typical Minetti type response there. That's on the, the, that's on the right? Yeah, hopefully you're filming that as I pulled it up. That's pre post, baby. In this week's episode, I got with my man, Dr. Eugene O'Neill from O'Neill Chiropractic Health and Wellness over in Branchburg. Doc, what's your one takeaway from today's podcast? Podcast by day, floor cleaner by night. But success isn't built upon that. Success is built upon the trials and the tribulations and the kind of the struggles and the journey. And trials and tribulations just create growth and opportunity. And if you don't go through it, you're never gonna really become truly successful. Half an hour window from now until the podcast with Cheech own. Three things you can control, right? And what you put in your in your your mind, your thoughts. You can control how how you move, your exercise, and you can control what you eat. This guy to do an outline every time we talk, and it's always like, yeah, I got an outline up here. <laughs> Phase one is one week of power and strength, one week of hypertrophy, one week of strength uh, of conditioning. 1.2 is a little bit more volume, a little bit more advanced techniques, bodybuilding techniques. Hell, you're afraid to move because you don't want to break. But that's really where the magic happens when you break through. So don't break down when you're about to break through. Reading the book, taking notes, and figuring this damn thing out, and doing it not because um, I want to all the time, but doing it because it's my calling, and fucking documentation of this whole process is the art of it. What's up, buddy? Yeah, that weighs uh, three pounds. <laughs> Body by Anthony Minetti. Any words, Karen? Oh, geez, where do we start? And we're both together. Gonna make uh, this a huge success. Or 14 and three quarters. Wow. Mind you, I just got done 
Not cold. There's a little bit of pump in there. 16. 16. 25. Whoa! 17 and three quarters. Well, man. But. There's a speaker in this bitch. Nothing can stop me. I'm all the way. Show what you want. Show it what you need. My niggas run the game. We ain't never leave. Never leave. Counting up money. We ain't never sleep. You got V12. I got 12 V. Go all the way up. Go all the way up. Go all the way up. I want to be you when I grow up, man. You know him from my peaks. <laughs> I was always hoping that I wouldn't lose that. To be honest with you, everything looks great. So, post-workout, your recovery should be mostly protein right after. You have about a 45-minute window to get some solid protein in. I, J-Rock, of Style Mind and Body, don't know what 311 is. This is all 311. It's 311 today. Brainstorm, taking you away from the norm. Mindset, you got weight on your back, trying to pull weight off the floor, deadlift, weight on your back, on your spine, squat. It's not an easy exercise. I, mean, I still love it, I love when I'm done. But going through it, it's still not, not easy, man, you know? Now bring it forward to me, right there. You just went from here to here. The culture that we have here with the people who are here and the coaches and just the energy is hard to describe to people um, unless you're in it. I'm in constant search of that thing and I'm still a little uneasy about not having it. Of course. So, and again, that's that's Project My Life though. So the overarching theme is Project My Life and how it's an endless kind of search for, for self. Are we fighting? What's up, Dale? What are you doing, bro? As a man, testosterone, more, yeah. as the workout, as the being on the on the mm -hmm. streets, yeah. like you need fuel, you need protein. Right. And maybe I, maybe it's my fault maybe for you're not, not. You don't want to hear from maybe, me. No, you're, <laughs> you're, 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 I'm saying you. Maybe you're right. Maybe it's I still have to keep that kind of you know that thing going. Where like, no, dude, send it to me. Like I still want to hold you accountable for it. That sounds great, but it's like, all right, well, who the how, how do we figure out serving sizes now? This is where the magic, I think, really happens. Here's what I have found to work really great. I also have a visual step-by-step -step I'm going to send you, okay? I just want to get there and give a little bit of water. That was a 19 Jersey Cup Classic. Uh, if you're not here today, that's okay. We have one coming up next week, April 6th. I'm so good with that. And also... Been promoting this competition now since 2011, the Jersey Cup Classic. Miss Hannah, you don't have to cross your legs on this one. If you want to give a little hip here, give a little hip here, you can look over. Yeah, you, you're so cute. That's the big tape we get to see when you're doing your front legs. You're, you're fucking I've been influencing before your influencers influence was a thing. Oh yeah, that was the guy from TV. If you found something valuable about that episode, that was just me becoming a bodybuilder. To this day, I still remember you saying how you work out before going to work at 5 a.m. Most people sleep, but you were always focused. Thank you very much for that comment. I manifest it by putting it out, and that's what creates more of it, you know? And this place is, we weed out the toxicity and breed positivity. Slight movements and slight movements. You really need to initiate that with your hips first. Oh, dang. <laughs> that could be much more, uh, much more appealing than that. 
Disaster going on over here, a little bit of disaster. We like to create obstacles. This was all pouring down water. As you can see, I don't know how much damage is going on up there, but. Jersey Cup! Jersey Cup! Jersey Cup! But you're gonna do the best you can and stand up there and be proud and then we, you know, take it to the next level, whatever you wanna do. Well, I'm, I'm so impressed. I'm not just saying that. I'm so impressed with your posing. It's incredible. Thank you. The first year we, we did the show, we were inexperienced, right? So we didn't know what we were doing, and we were literally still putting plaques on in between prejudging to the night show. But this is our way, right? Like, we took over a show that was already in existence, and we just kept the name for ease of marketing purposes, but if we're gonna keep it as ours, then let's... It's gotta be ours. Let's, let's make it ours, man. Jersey Cup is today, April 27, 2019. Been prepping for it. You've been hearing about it. Today's the day. Anyway, I'm all over the place, but my point is you're here, you're having a good time. Nothing you can do from now until the stage time will ever change how you look and how you, how you place. Thank you. Judging will bring you out with your class. So you hit your figure side pose. Now that I'm building up one, two, three, three. Like a oh god. I don't even know. It just hasn't stopped bleeding. Well, we're gonna. I sliced up my fingers. Could have been a lot worse, Karen. Is this different training than you usually do? Exactly what I do. It's good to see smoke good training people doing. This is classic bodybuilding stuff, old school. It's where magic happens, so. Start workout. Project my life is a it's a movement. People inspiring people. Figure out what you want, what you need, and then go after it. Hopefully share, hopefully inspire somebody else to do what they gotta do to get what they need to be in life. What the f it doesn't mean you're you. that you're in your fucking imagination. Like, I was the guy in the outfield like fucking trying to avoid being hit. That's fucking boring, dude. How do you get so passionate about standing up on stage in your fucking underwear? Every day's not gonna be, you know, peaches and fucking cream and um yeah. man. With where you are right now. Fucking brilliant. So fucking brilliant, dude. You know what I mean? Like, you know what I'm talking about. We have the same I can love this dude. It's like. One day you're like, you know, fucking I'm the man. And then the next day you're like, I suck. Damn, bro. I can sit here and talk to you for fucking out. Oh, and you were just saying the F word every two seconds. 